Hello my friends, my name is Dragonheart the Prince of Wales and welcome to episode 5 of my Elith Anar campaign with Nagarith and the High Elves. So I've got a couple of things to talk about at the start, a couple of observations. I did mention previously about this hit list and how hard it would be to take out some of these factions when you consider that they are quite a distance away. Well, I think there's a way I can do it. If I show you my rights, there's this guy by here, the Hand of the Shadow Crown. He is a unique hero, capable of assassinating him without fail, and he will be summoned to my faction's capital. Um, this right will unlock after issuing the Reaver Patrol's commandment over a province. Now, Reaver's Control commandment. It's this one by here, look. If I could do that, spend my two and a half grand and actually get this assassin, and once I do that, I could perhaps send him. He's a 100% kill rate as well, so pretty much guaranteed kills all the time. That will be a quick way of doing it. So just a little tip for you guys there. Second tip, the Moon Dragon. So I've got a Moon Dragon. You might start off your Let's Play now or your campaign with this faction, and you'll notice you haven't got a Moon Dragon. That is because the Moon Dragon was a placeholder for the early access build, which is what I'm using, obviously, Shadow for my lands. save. But if you do start a new campaign with Aletha Lana, he actually has a Eagle. I think it's to do with rebalancing this region because there's Skaven around here, Clan Rictus. I think sending Clan Rictus up against a dragon early on is a little bit cruel. Animal cruelty, guys. So they've decided to nerf them a little bit and not actually have this moon dragon. But I've obviously got the moon dragon here. Thirdly, this is my final point I want to make before I actually start off the episode properly. I've played a turn. As you can see, my economy is a little bit different. I've disbanded a couple more units down here. I've sorted a few things out. I've got a bit more... Um, many of some of the elven factions that were willing to give me money and also this uh, uh, army here by Deadwood Sentinels has been passive and hasn't moved out at all this is the army that is full of the Dark Riders now I could go and meet them to battle however the frozen city is right around the corner here so I'm gonna go and attack it I might suffer some attrition on the way but I have a dragon don't forget I do sure, in fact sorry. have a moon dragon which I keep reminding you guys of yes we've suffered slight attrition here and yes, I could wait They're turns free. to get myself some equipment, but I'd rather go and fight this now because I've got the men to do this. Fear us. Well, let's do it. Let's go in. Let's fight this battle. Let's take the frozen city for ourselves. To me, Shadow Warriors. Land. Now, I don't know if I'm going to go much further across the north. Nagareth prepares for war once more. The harsh winters of the north of this land, so... I think I'll just wipe out this faction, take all of this, build up a second full province so I've got a bit of money behind me, and then I'll go after proper quests and do the campaign that way by trying to build up my influence and my intrigue at court and play in like a proper elvish uh, faction. So this is where we start off, guys. Ooh, this is a beautiful city, isn't it? You can tell it's dark elven as well. Okay, let's not, let's not disappoint in this battle. We're going to have all our spears in one gigantic line like so. Gonna stretch the enemy here. Spearmen. My shadow walkers and my archers, of course, as well. Who can be grouped up? We're ready. It shall be done. The moon dragon and a lethanar. Be grouped up as well. Group one's gonna climb. Group two's gonna fire. It shall be done. And lethanar. I would like Alethanar to find Moon Dragon. Let's get you involved. You're going to go along this right flank here, away from these towers. Get out of the range of the towers to begin with. Let's fast forward this slightly as they march as well. Not an awful lot going on here. And three, two, one. Beautiful. I could probably uh, fly him around here. But I think it's best not to land him and just keep him sort of up high for the time being and let's get dragon breath on these dread spears here we go come up flank have some of that to warm up your cotton socks in this harsh reality this harsh weather that we have <laughs> oh i love dragons you can see why they've nerfed it I, I i'm disappointed but i do have this save so i can still enjoy my moon dragon for my own kind of doing if it were but Obviously, if um, you know if you guys are playing this campaign, you're starting one off. This might not be wise. Okay, let's go against this lord. What is he? What type of lord are we talking about here? 
the melee specialist. Maybe you don't want to attack him in that case. I'm going to circle around. I'm just going to keep my dragon behind closed doors right now. He's not getting attacked anyway, so we can just sort of use our fear effects at the moment to obviously give them fear. Okay, at least the on the wall behind them right now. My troops are mounting up. I'm going to breathe fire from behind them. I'm actually going to show you this in close motion here. Slow, slow, close motion. Let's go. Let's slow it down. Let's slow this down for you guys. You want to see this, don't you? Slow motion. Dragon fire. Oh, this is going to be epic. Slow motion. And it's there. Right down into their spines. Blood everywhere. And that's just decimated them completely. There we go. And the fun. Let's be serious. We are serious total war players after all. Let's continue the fight. That was worth the wait though. Right. I've got you guys now shooting nothing for some reason. You're being really, really perverse in your attack minds here. Yeah. Matter of fact. Wouldn't mind it if two of you guys could actually push on up over the over there and attack their lord. Uh, you go to melee, you're actually decent enough in melee. Oh, I should have used I just forgot to use mislead. It's not an issue. It's not an issue at all. Winning decisively move dragon, that's always a nice thing to see. I could send the dragon onto their lord. I'm gonna pull up with the dragon actually. Pull him out. Pull the dragon out because you can start using some of his uh, beautiful, beautiful skills and set. Right, you guys have actually broken these guys. Let's pull a couple of you guys up. My spears are doing decent enough. Pull three of them down. Right, dragon. Dragon, 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 dragon ball Z. Right. Moon dragon. Go for the death hag. Fire in the hole! Oh, yeah. And then follow it up by charging him. Again, in on him. We've got terror as well, should actually help out. Yeah, definitely the best option by, by charging these guys and actually going completely for it here. They just can't cope at all. Spears, get up on the balls. Uh, not spears, beg your pardon. Archers, get up there and have a moon dragon. How you doing? Winning slightly, not good enough really, but slightly is better than nothing. Let's get some spears. Let's get some spears up here to help out. Oh, there we go. Don't need them after all. And we've won. We don't have to follow this battle up. So it's ended there. Decisive victory. And yeah, I'm really happy with that. We only lost just under 200. 92 kills for the Moon Dragon there. Kills split evenly amongst the archers. The infantry didn't hardly have to get involved either. Even the Lethanar didn't really have to get involved that much. We totally slaughtered them. The dragon himself was was very capable of taking out large swarms of troops there. Took out about two thirds of their army. Let's take that. I'm also going to occupy this because I want the income. I want the ooh the trait gold sigil sword melee attack and defense. Quest being aborted raid. I don't need to raid. I could have raided from Twins and Fortune. Illuminate the Shadowlands. And now I've got a quest. This will issue fund the war. The following effort. battle with the Lethanar's army, the Moonbow. Actually, get the Moonbow, which is a unique item of his, which causes powerful explosions. Good against a single unit. Extra range to missile damage. Effective at long range, and it causes armor piercing. Now that battle is all the way over there. I can teleport there. And I get bonus experience. I will do that quest. I would like to do that quest. So we will think about doing that shortly. Speaking of quests, yeah, that's the only proper quest I have. The other ones are missions. And because you've taken Frozen City now, they're going to be weakened quite a bit. And we've got we've got income again, which is good. Now the Frozen City ones they have we've got a public order building, which is absolutely amazing. It's what I wanted. Public order. I got another one being built as well. Elven artisans giving me elven trinket resources and income. A bit of money coming in as well. Right, we'll heal up for a couple of turns. I think we'll probably think about going south for Nagra next. We've got to try and take out the army at Nagra. They take Dargroth, they take Dargroth. I don't really care at this point. No, this the here. Shadowlands. Probably being wasted. Oh, actually, we'll keep him here because we might have a rebellion in a short period of time. Let us get ourselves more public order while we can afford it then. And then I think, yeah, you're happy to stay here. Order for now. Must be maintained. Recruit one hero and also capture and occupy Vol's anvil. That's going to be tricky because Vol's anvil is all the way over there. 
Can I offer assistance? Out of all I think it might be actually be yeah. Yeah, that's it for the it's asking a lot of me to get there, unfortunately. But we'll try our best, maybe we can. Sword of Cain. I kind of want to take the Sword of Cain to myself. I am a greedy elf after all. And who is this? Argol. I want to go in the north and take all these lands. I probably don't. Probably don't, but I might do anyway just for the sake of it. Just for the sake of greed. I might just do that. Right. Happy enough with that. We'll... Yeah, we'll take out this guy next. Go ahead and turn now. Ooh, there's some trinkets. Actually, Hunt. don't do that for me. Make use, make use of you. Get you in force march as well. Don't need any short sighted risers. Get you in that ocean. I get a rebellion. I can deal with it. Minus a uh, plus two is going up anyway. Course. Public order. Beautiful. Let's actually get like you into the, the mysterious land and get that for me next turn. Right, end turn. Done quite a lot in a short period of time right now. What does the Lariel want? Defensive alliance with the Lariel. That would be us. quite tempting. I'm I'm tempted, I must admit. I'm tempted, but I'm tempted. Welcome to Nagamish, financial gain. So will you give me money? I hope it's not oh, too yes, you will. shocking. I think she's our bit on the side of Lariel at the moment. She seems to be very forthcoming with giving me good gifts. Whether it be money or defensive alliances. Oh dear. Oh, okay. Why did you move <laughs> a sea battle? And of course, I can't fight sea battles, so I have to auto this, unfortunately. It says we nail battles, maybe be auto resolved. Ironically, they've actually. I can see what they've got. They've got a whole. a hell of a lot of Dark Rider horse spam, which you mentioned last episode, on transport ships. I don't know why they went to the sea. That doesn't make much sense to me at all, why they would do that. There's also another um, campaign mechanic I want to mention, which I haven't really t talked about too much. Yeah, I lost that lord, but that's fine. He's going to only be my my dude around here, which I can build up in a turn, to be fair. I can build up two of these to build public order up and just not worry about what's going on at home too much. Right, I can't sit here with you. You have to move out now. You don't force march. I'm so annoyed that you can't. The people arrested. Get there this turn though. I could go for Chagrath. There was only oh, not, though. Ill considered. Ah, uh, see. Not one rupee as well. on Nagarith. But I can use this the Shadow Realm pathways. I don't get attrition by using this. No. Let's be aggressive. Twilight is here. We're not going to suffer any attrition right now. You want me? Come and get me. That is the question I'm posing to them right now. Like two turns and three turns. I've got time on my side. I've got three turns. So I should hopefully be able to dances, quell power of order issues here without having to get another lord. I don't know why they came down there to Never. do that. That was rather um, bizarre, but whatever. There's another one by here as well. Another shipwreck. Remnants of battles. Quite a few of them scattered around the place. So it might be worth just getting a lord to do all of these. But obviously if a enemy share is going to be quite difficult. Can I get anything else with my dudes? Let's find out. Um, Avalon. Let's see how much you do like me. Dash the rocks with traitor's blood. Not that much. Damn it. I thought we had something going on, Avalon. Alariel, rather. Alariel, the ever queen of Avalon. Queen of Avalon. Faithful but you broke my heart. You horrible, horrible fiend. What brings you here? How dare this cannot you? Happen. Oh well, it does happen sometimes. Speed this up as well. Da-dee-da. Draw some uh, paint on the mountains there. Draw some paint for the sake of it. Right. Yeah, they didn't... <laughs> they're in force march still. Are you sure? Bigger in battle is tired. They're going to be tired. Should the army attack, retreat will be impossible. If it loses the battle, it'll be wiped out. Making this too easy for me, man. Making this too easy for me. Oh. You fiend. Yeah. I'm going to go up against all of this. Shadow I have stop. faith because I am a lethanar. Quick save Attack and fight now. this battle. Yeah, I'm, I'm going for it. From the I'm shadows. that confident in my army. Let's take a quick sip of my diet Pepsi. I am that confident in my army because to me, we have a Shadow dragon. Warriors. Okay, he's taking a bit of a beat in. But he's a very experienced dragon. They have a lot of cavalry. 
Cavalry don't like spears. I have a lot of spears. I also have a lot of archer spam. If I keep my army compact, I believe we can be victorious in today's battle. So let's keep to our promise. Group up our spears like so. Matter of fact, let's change this around. Oh dear. Spearman. What am I doing? Right. I'm not very good when it comes to organizing these things. Right. I want the two weaker ones Spearman. in the middle. And then. It will like be that. done. Enough Understood. Better. Good block with you. Elite and at the front. It will be done. All my bows. Gonna be right in the front Spearman. line here. Without fail. Come at me, bro. It will be done. Come at me, bro. Or I am a Lethanar. Right, a Lethanar, guess what? It shall be done. Lowest champion. Give me this lead. Got here. Dark Riders. My dragon. Vengeance. Gonna have fun burning some cavalry. I will have to slow this battle down in, in moments. I give the orders. So apologies about that. set up my spears in such a way where outflanking me won't necessarily be easy. Okay, let's slow down things a bit. Yeah, I'm sending the dragon against all of these. Fight me. Fight me, boy. Fight. Yeah, my dragon's getting the absolute shite kicked out of him right now. React for a moment. Okay, you know my archers. Put them all off. Skirmish. This is gonna be fun now. Just stay there for now. One of those big battles where it's really epic, but at the same time I could lose easily. <laughs> That's what this is right now. The Black Art Corsairs, I think I, I'm behind the lines, I may as well go for it. I can't really see... Yeah, I can't see them lasting long against Spears. All my Spears, guard. Hold that line with it. Okay, I might get outflanked on this side. I'll have to just pull some units back and sort that out. That's fine, right. Alethana. At the center of the line here. I want you to keep firing upon that death hag for me. Say a lord, the dragon's gonna have a little word with him. We're indecisively right now against this black arc corsair. Let us continue the festivities for a moment. Might not want to dwell here. Let's not dwell, let's just pull out with him. I'm pulling units back. That's fine. They've gone crashing into my flanks. Yeah, I'm sending cavalry against spears. Like I said, I got a lot of spears, so they can do that if they want to, but I wouldn't if I was them. I'm gonna get caught up on the spears here. Send this archer unit in to help out. Matter of fact, the moon dragon needs to get away. Hurry up. Hurry up, run, you dragon! I will be burning fire, blowing fire onto them in a moment once he takes, takes flight. Take flight for me! Right, you idiot. Right, he's up. As he's as he's up in the air, just blow him with fire on the way back. Just turn around, blow it. I'm not going to watch this because I'm going to watch the battle instead over here and just make sure I'm not making any grave mistakes. Because that's very easily done. We've got to keep our focus on the front lines right now. Yeah, the spear infantry is taking fire here. Push up and help out there. Break your line there. You're in combat. Get up and help out. We're all here to hold the line here. Lethanar. May need to use your combat expertise in a moment. Right, they're behind, so Lethanar. Face them down. Do that there. Sword and crossbow might not be getting good against a dragon. 
Dragon's still over half health still. It's not a problem at all. It's gonna be like a feature length episode this is. Right. Switch that up. Shoot those dark riders for me. Right, you can be used over this flank now. Normal speed. Release and no. Take out the Lord. Take out the Lord, I snipe them. Easy, happy days. Yeah, they keep crash crashing their cavalry into my lines here. Ridiculous. What they're trying to do. The Shadow Keep. He's quite good in, in battle. Loyal. Is that okay? Kill them. Pop another one in. The Shadow King. How about even? Might him for me. Glory awaits. Scion of Anarion. Got a dragon out there. Quickly. They're turning all their troops around, trying to take out my dragon. Destroy them. Get him out the of the way. Basically. Victory well, I don't want to lose the dragon, but happy for him to have this something happen. Right. Well, we can spare troops now, we will. So you can all push up. Loyal! We will obey! Sinner! Just trying to keep As you say, formation going, we basically. We're going to use hammer and anvil hit and run tactics Spearman. constantly. Understood. Right, you're out of the way, you're out of the woods. Attack! We are pace! Okay, you go. Flying out of the way up in the mountains by here. Are they going to be using the Dark Elf and magic shit that they like using? We can do that, that's fine. Bounce power is in my favour slightly. I got spears up against Dark Riders here, so they don't really stand much of a chance. They keep shooting the shit out of them, please, and you as well. Ignore those Dark Riders that are coming, because they, they're not going to last too long. Yeah, look at those Dark Spearman. Riders morale just dropping like shit. Alitha, now, how are you doing in combat, by the way? Oh shit, you lose it, okay, blew up. I thought you'd be stronger than that. Obviously, you're not quite up for fighting against a death hag specialist, so we'll pull you out for now. That's fine. Are you keep coming back or not? Right, dragon, I'll go over here. Get back into the battle and just take out anything that's moving. Okay, I got spears on all of these here. That's right, pull them back. Pull back with you. This is where we need to lose now. This part of the, of the battlefield needs to start breaking them. Shoot the Black Oak Corsairs. Shoot the Black Oak Corsairs. Spears on the Bleak Swords. Just get into them. You're holding still. That's nice. I like, I like the fact you're still holding. Defend oh my Loyal. Kill them. Take that out for me. Spearman. Dragon. Nice to see you. Welcome back to the battlefield. Get over here. Need over here. Right. Elitha now. Scion of Anarion. Use mislead one more time. Lovely. Very well. Right, you. Shoot them. Shoot them all that are coming back. You. Get over to this main part of the battlefield. Understood. Yeah, charge those black dark corsairs for me. Not shoot them, charge them in the face. Break formation. Spearmen break formation and push down the hill now. Actually, don't push this way instead and flank them. Two of you, shoot the Lord. You shall be shoot done. the Lord. Be Spearman. my maker and shoot the Lord. It will be done. Setting for. Good then, mate. How are you doing? Moving out. That's a shame. Shoot the general. In that case. Taking some losses here. But I think we won this easily. Well, I think we won. Kind of know what we're coming from this. Funny thing is, they lose all their army by losing this battle. To victory awaits. Often see that keep coming back all the time as well. March. Acknowledge. Defending all. Burn. Their Lord, burn yes. him and break him, please. Last lane for you. Mm, the dark Rider chasing me. Come on, hurry up and blow it. Blow it, you silly dragon. There you go. Follow up with the charge as well, please. 
Oh, the, yeah, this is where all the best stuff is for here, right? You go over and start shooting these. Send you in. I'll send you all into this. Charge up. Right, push them. Push up. Push up on the black arc, Corsairs. It will be done. The Lord's going. <laughs> For a oh my god. Making a bit of a mock well, not a mockery, but we're making a bit of a meal of it, aren't we? It's just the set down over there is on break at all. I'm hoping they're pushing some more troops in the start making them yeah, there we go. That's made a bit of a difference. They lose their whole army, see, by losing this battle. It worked out nicely, it did. Damn. Charge them. Dragons Battle on the front line. Dragons got 28 kills. I thought he had a lot more now. I didn't use him as hit and run though. He's been like a cavalry unit to me, really. That's what I could do with Cav. I'm using a dragon as cavalry. <laughs> kind of says it all, doesn't it? Oh, we've killed the Lord. Lovely. Right, get over there now. You can probably break those dark shards with the charge on them. Archers. I think I've won this. For all I was outnumbered, to be fair. I know you might be saying, oh, they should have made that dragon. It was a difficult battle, right? It was a difficult battle. I've lost a lot of troops by doing so. But, Understood. yeah, Pyrrhic victory, Understood. I'll take that any day, because, yeah, we're up against their two away. armies. Okay, I slightly outnumbered the one. The other one was like a garrison. They had a hell of a lot of spam I had to deal with there. That's why I had to stay a static formation. I could have perhaps made my formation better at the start. I kept my... I think if I'd kept my infantry on the outside and then my archers on the inside, I think I would have not lost as many. I've lost some troops here, unfortunately, some archer units. Luckily, some of these just basic archers, not archers with light armor, so I can actually... I was probably going to replace them anyway. The Shadow Dancer brings fortune. Oh, that was a fantastic victory. And with that, we've, we've basically got this whole region for ourselves. We can take Shagrath now at the start of the next episode. Let's just level him up. Leave and nothing. Something. The uh, Shadow uh, King uh, rises. Public order, local province, maybe? I don't know. I think I'll make him better in battle. A leaf or not. Don't know what to give him, though. Stalk is such a good thing to get. Let's get infiltration. We've still got 17 of our units out of 20. That's not bad. And I can still recruit some more. Although it is global, I'd rather not do it globally. But we'll replenish that. And in the next episode, we'll go to Shagrath and take the last remaining... Um, Set city in this settlement, this province. We'll then get ourselves some public um, or province options here. We'll get Reaper patrols so I can lock the assassin, which will be absolutely amazing. We can actually upgrade a settlement here as well, which has just caught my eye, which we'll, we'll do. We'll upgrade Coron order And I think we'll end the episode here. I've been Dragonheart. Thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye. Thank you for watching the video. I want to say a massive thank you to all my patrons and all my sponsors on YouTube Gaming. They're currently on the screen right now. For more information, check out all the links in my description and check out the links on the screen as well.